In a world that sometimes likes to focus on just the negativity, I like to take a second each day to find one good thing. Today's good thing, religion. My one comment on yesterday's video said, teach the proclamation of the kingdom to all of the non-Christians. No, I'm not going to do it. Now, Anders, I'm sure that comment came with the best intentions, and I'm sure you just wanted to spread love. But the reason why I'm not going to do it is because I feel like telling others to believe a certain religion is kind of condescending to anyone that doesn't have the same beliefs. It's saying, we're better than you, and you're dumb. We need to enlighten you. And I don't believe that. I feel like you can believe in whatever you want. You can, believe, you can be Christian. You can be Buddhist. You can be Islamic. You can be atheist. You can be pizzaist. As long as you love each other, that's all that matters. That's all that counts for me. I'm not into the labels of, oh, he's a Christian. He's Islamic. He's Buddhist. They can't talk to each other. That just divides us once we put those labels on it. Sure, it's okay to identify with those labels, but if it separates us instead of unites us, then I think it does more harm than good. So that's why I'm not going to proclaim a certain religion on everyone telling them they should do that. My proclamation, or me as a preacher, is just saying love each other. That's the bottom line, and that's all I really care about. I've come across some amazing Christians. I've come across some amazing atheists. I think that's a YouTube channel, actually. And as long as they're loving and treat people with respect, what else can you ask for? Now, someone came to me and was like, Luke, I'm lost on my spiritual journey. Let's talk about religion. What do you think? Well, then I'll share my religious beliefs, but I'm not going to push on people that aren't asking for it. That's not my job. I don't feel like that's anyone's job. If you want to do it, do it in a loving way, in a non-condescending way, go for it. That's just not me. So today's one good thing is taking a comment and kind of flipping it to find the good thing. And it's the freedom of religion or the freedom of non-religion. If you can think of any other one good things, leave a comment below or send me an email at the link in the description. I'm Luke, and I'll see you tomorrow.